most modern missiles can destroy any target with high precision. <laughs> However, they have one weakness. Most of these missiles can't penetrate hardened targets like reinforced concrete or deep underground bunkers. That's why countries like the US and Russia have built modern bunker buster bombs. One such powerful bunker buster bomb, GBU-28, was used during the Operation Desert Storm by the U.S. Air Force. Some military experts say that this bomb could have played an important role in ending the Gulf War. The Bunker Buster is a specially designed bomb that can penetrate a long way underground before it explodes. Powerful bunker busters can pierce through 100 feet in ground and up to 20 feet of solid concrete before erupting below the surface. Bunker buster bombs get their incredible power from their special design and basic physics. To penetrate hard surfaces, bunker busters rely on high momentum, and thus they are designed long and narrow to minimize the aerodynamic drag. The outer casing of the bomb is also made of thickened steel, which gives it increased strength. The bomb is dropped from a considerable height to impart a high kinetic energy. Once it hits the ground, the bunker buster pierces straight through the hardened surface. Typically, there needs to be a delay before the bomb goes off. This is done by using a delay fuse or a hard target smart fuse so that the bomb doesn't blow up before it hits its target. The bomb is guided by a laser guidance system towards its designated target. GBU-57 and KMB-1500 LPR are some of the powerful bunker busters in the US and Russian arsenal respectively. Although scary, these unbelievably powerful bunker busters can penetrate any terrorist bunker in the world. <laughs>